Okay, Bola Buddies, I ordered this box on May 19th <laughs> and I have been putting it off. Hey, Bola Buddies, thanks for watching. Full time reseller. All right, let's get started. Because I'm going to show you how much stuff is in it. And when I open this box, what I typically do for this video is I list everything in the box. Um, I did a video like this before and I purchased the item, this box from auctions for you. And I'll do a screenshot of her channel and link it below for you guys. But I, my first vintage box I bought from her, it was a vintage toy box. I paid $100 for it and I have a video on it and I made so much money on that box. It was amazing. Now, um, this is the second box that I ordered shortly after, but I just have not had the time to uh, really focus on getting it uh, listed because of garage sale season. I was sourcing every weekend. So garage sale season in Ohio is winding down. So just a second here. Okay. Um, so anyway, garage sale season's pretty much over. Uh, I can still go to estate sales and thrift stores, but um, I have decided it is time to open the box. And I'm pretty excited about it. You guys know that I love toys. Um, this box is pretty massive. Um, so do I know what's in here? No, I do not. I saw a picture of a tote and I'll pop it up right here. And it was stacked to the top. And I can see a few things, but overall, I mean, I had already told her I wanted the box before I saw the picture. So, okay. So we're just going to go through this. Um, let me get a bag to put this paper in and I'll be right back. All right. I pulled the paper out. There was only like three newspaper sheets. Um, so not too bad at all. Again, I have no idea. I'm trying to think of the best way to do this. Let me move the box here um i'll be right back all right we just got rid of that flap so it's not going to be in our way um it looks like some of the stuff is in mailers so we're just going to start with those i don't know why i don't know if it's going to be a category or if it's something that's more delicate because this is a bubble mailer so we're just going to see Okay, now you guys are going to look at this stuff and you're going to be like, okay, and when I do the, when I do the video, you're going to see the value in some of these items. Now that one, M-A-R, so I don't know what that means, so I will have to look that up. Most of these toys are dirty and will need cleaned up. That's how it was the last time. This line is from the Fisher Price Circus. Um, we'll need cleaned up. I don't know what this is. It's a little egg container. So some of these things I will have to Google lens. Maybe that's for a dollhouse. This is for Fisher Price Little People. So T bought a, um, auctions for you, bought a storage unit that was packed with vintage toys. So these are items that came out of that. This one is, says Disney, but the last box I got, there was a lot of damaged items and those damaged items were vintage and I sold them for really good money. So if you go watch that video, you will see what I mean. Here's a little people guy. Um, I have sold these before. These are missing the key cover, but somebody may need these as replacements. They're Power Ranger keys. Uh, a little horse. This I think is a Things twisting. Fisher Price little people um, thing. I mean, there's going to be things in here that some of it I'll just toss. Okay, so we've got this. I don't know who that is. Does anybody know? 
by the time I do the video, I will probably know, but it's dated 2000. I can't read what it says. This is a little poly pocket, looks vintage. Sometimes those do pretty good, so I'll look her up. This is why I have been putting it off, you guys, because it takes forever to list all these smalls. Um, I'll probably put these in a nice uh, little bath and let them soak. This is from 1972. It's a Fisher Price toy, but you can see it's pretty dirty. Um, this is a little Tykes chair. I have sold these before. I've sold them in blue. That, I'm hoping I'll be able to find some other ones that go with it. You guys know that I've been selling the Fisher Price Little People. Here's the dog. This, um, don't see any markings. I'll have to use Google Lens. A nice soak. Uh, this I will not be able to soak because it has a sticker. That I don't recognize either. So, um, have to see if I can find it. These are the, whoa. Hold on. Chair. These sit down in it like that. Okay, so here's the key guy. Guys, um, that one's not staying down. So maybe it's broken. I don't know. But this is what it looks. Oh, there it goes. That's what they look like or supposed to look like. But I can sell the others as replacements. Here's another chair. Oh my gosh, you guys, there's so much in just this one bag. Um, another chair, um, chair, person, I have no idea what this is. What is that? Marshmallow cream. Huh. I, I don't know. Really dirty chair and another little girl. This is some sort of uh, McDonald's toy replacement something, so I probably won't do anything with that. This is a um, Dalmatian dog, but it's a pencil top, see? Troll. Another key, and again, I have sold these before, so I know I can sell those. Um, a little dollhouse stove more people. You guys, these are worth looking up individually. Sometimes um, they can be sold individually and do well. Sometimes I lock them up. Here's a Fisher Price dog. That one's pretty old too. It's made in Hong Kong. I don't know what that is. It's a piece to something. Ah, he is old guys. Is that Ernie? A couple more chairs. chair course well, it says something on the bottom so I will look it up just in case another little lady here chair milk another girl This dog is missing an ear, so it's damaged. But um, I might just, I don't know. I don't know what I'll do with that. Another chair, this little guy, little bunny. And it says 2000, and it's the same brand as that other one I pulled up. So this one here. So these must be some sort of TV show or something. Here's another horse, and it has a marking on the bottom, so I'll look that up. This went to like a dollhouse or something, but it's missing some stuff. And we have one more little girl right here. Okay, so that's the first bag. That's empty. Let's do another one. Before I do another one, I'm gonna pull out this car and this airplane that's just on the top of the box. I can't wait to show you guys how much these smalls add up to. It is definitely a lot of work. Um, 
but I love toys. So, whoa, sorry, hit the camera. Another little Tykes chair, so that's awesome. This one is a Fisher Price 1993. She knows I like selling dollhouse furniture, so um, I wouldn't be surprised if I saw some more. This is some a wagon. I'm not sure what it goes to. I'll have to Google lens it. Uh, Toy Max 1996. It looks like it lights up. Another girl here. Um, Jasmine horse. A head. It's interesting. Never seen one like that. Um, so we got her. This guy. Who's this guy? Fisher Price. Wow, never seen him. 1996. So I would definitely look him up. He looks old. I wonder what he does. I think it's just arms move. I uh, don't know who this is. It's made by Disney, so it's a Disney character. This one says LJ in Toys 19 something, 88 maybe? What on earth? I'm definitely looking that up. Some of these things may surprise you. I'm going to be popping up screen shares of how I listed everything. So you will probably see a screenshot right there. Okay, this is, I don't know, it doesn't say Fisher Price. Typically it's marked Fisher Price if it's Fisher Price. This is definitely a um, Fisher Price, but she is pretty dirty. Um, you can even sell the skirts separately if you don't have the doll and you find a skirt. Uh, this is just really, I don't know what that brand is. So I, I threw a couple others, a couple more chairs. Mm, Fisher Price, 1999. Never seen that one. That should be fun. Uh, can't read it. I have to you guys read that. Is that a pencil topper? Maybe we have this old phone booth that is also Fisher Price. I think that says 1980. There's another table. A um, couple more kids here. Her hair is broken. boom box looks like Barbie or something another key um, not dated but that's awesome Power Ranger key Fisher Price car I'm looking for red lines on the wheels another chair and one more baby. Boom. All right, let's keep going here. Moving right along. This is going to be a long video, guys. Maybe I'll split it up into two, but I'd like to keep it all together. Just, um, again, I paid $100 for this box. Okay. This is just a McDonald's toy. It's got uh, like a little snow globe. This is a Playmobil guy. We have this guy right here. Uh, this is some sort of snorkeling backpack replacement accessory. I can try and look that up. If anybody knows what it is, let me know. Another one of this guy. Another chair. Cars. Yeah, you guys are gonna be amazed at how much I'm gonna turn this box into. It's gonna be a lot of work, but um, I don't know what she is. Mattel for McDonald's. So that's a McDonald's toy. This guy's pretty cool. Kind of excited to look him up. Um, he says Henson. So, is he a Muppet? Orange chair. Cowboy. Don't 
dump truck. This says Mattel 2002. It's a hair clip. I'm not sure what she's from. I feel like I should know. This guy. A hat that goes to something. I believe this is an old McDonald's toy as well. But look up some of the old ones because sometimes they can be a great bread and butter. Like this one, low fat milk from McDonald's. This is one of the transforming ones. So um, it's dated 1993. It is yellowing a little bit, but I think I can still sell it. There's a couple more chairs. Lots of chairs, right? Another McDonald's toy. Fire hydrant, I think that's Fisher Price. Don't know. Toilet. Even if I don't know what it is, I'm gonna hang on to it because I may find the missing piece or part in something else. Um, don't know. Don't know. Another reason I like getting these boxes is because I learn a whole lot. This says Kraft Foods 1995. So sometimes those things. This is a little, um, it looks like a sippy cup for a doll. Like a Barbie or something. Okay, now we're getting into the big box. Another Fisher Price glass marbles. I have to look those up. Okay. Um, yuck. This says Mattel 2000. Barbie. <laughs> Cute, right? Another dude. Fisher Price guy. This, not sure what this is. Um, have to do Google Lens. I'm wondering if MAR is marks. Good. I'm definitely gonna research those. This is Mattel. 2000. Uh, this is from the Circus. Fisher Price Circus. Fisher Price Little People picnic table. Guessing that's a McDonald's toy. This is probably McDonald's also. Fisher Price, Little People, I think. Yeah. This girl right here, definitely gonna look her up. She's a vintage little cabbage patch. It's kinda interesting. This is another type of Fisher Price, but this one is um, more of the chunky rubbery type. There's that brand. Oh wait, it's MPC. Hmm, that'll help me research it. You guys, this box is loaded. Here's another. Here's another. Uh, this one is Play School. Play School does well also. Um, this is a couch. This is Fisher Price from 1993. That should clean up. Another, uh, I think that one's Fisher Price, yeah. See, she's missing her skirt. This one is also Fisher Price. Look, a mailman. A male lady, I should say. Fisher Price 95. Super cool. I don't know about this one. Never seen her. Disney for Burger King. Looks like it sticks onto something. This one is um, a Fisher Price also. I mean, there's some damage to some of these. I'll have to clean them up the best I can. I think people will still buy them. Look at that, that's cool. It's a helicopter, never seen one of those. 
Here's the, I think it's the dad, one of the dads, Fisher Price. Muppets. This is a um, CDI, I think. I don't know. It's interesting. It's McDonald's. Horse. Toy Story. Um, Disney, Pixar. I don't know. That's for McDonald's. Mr. Clean. It's just like a little, that's that CP, or CPI again. These can do well um, if you have a bunch of them. I think I'm thinking of the Wizard of Oz, but these are Adam Al At Madam Alexander dolls, but they're McDonald's. Fisher Price. The birthday cake. Uh oh. Look what I found. Raggedy Ann. It says heart to heart. And it's got a, a thing in it. A box. So definitely going to look that up. If you guys do not follow Chosen Goods Reseller, definitely go follow her. Um, I'll pop her channel up right here. Um, this battery, I, I'll have to test it. If it works, I'll put it over on my reseller testing products. Um, a video, if it doesn't, I'll just sell it as is. It's play school, it's really old, so um, if there's batteries in it, they're probably gonna be corroded. Fisher Price. Fisher Price. is a little car it says Mattel Hong Kong so that's vintage definitely gonna look that up okay <laughs> there's a train down here and it is stuffed with um there's this McDonald's french fry I've never seen that didn't I just have something else that was like a milkshake or something I don't know who this guy is if you guys recognize anything let me know in the comments this is a cute little Fisher Price girl. Oh, sorry, she's play school. They look so similar. Here's another one of those one characters. I don't know who this guy is. Is that Pluto? What on earth? You guys see it? Definitely have to look him up. He looks old, old, old. You got a dinosaur. You guys, she used every ounce of this box. This was this is what I've been grabbing from. It's a train. So we've got Aladdin. I don't know his name. Is his name Aladdin? Maybe it is. This little guy. Oops, he's on the floor. There's another one. Is that Arthur? Is that what his name is? I feel like I've sold him or had something like that before. Here's another horse. My goodness, there are some weird things that I've never seen in here. Turtle. Another one of those guys. So I should have a nice little set of this. Oh, this looks cool. Oh, you guys, this is 1994 Bluebird Toys Polly Pocket. Kind of excited about this. Look at that. That's kind of cool. I'm excited about that one. Okay. Um, look at this guy. I don't know if he's just a McDonald's toy or what. I have to do some research. Snoopy. And a lot of times these things are marked on the bottom. This is that Jasmine brand again. Don't, I'm not familiar with it. Um, there's a little, uh, that might, let's see, what is it? Serp, like for a Barbie or something. And then there's a bunch of marbles in here. So, 
Um, I don't know enough about marbles to know if there's anything good or not. Uh, just, I mean, that looks pretty. My ring light's making a... And then this was in there. Okay. And then the train itself. Another couch. Now that says M-A-R. So, okay, I thought it said M-A-R. Little plate. Mickey Mouse phone. I'll have to... Uh, Put a battery in it and see if it works. There's another marble. You guys, I'm gonna make my money back just on these little Fisher Price people. Little phone. I have no idea who he is. It says 1986 Soma. This, unless it ends up being something special, will more than likely get donated just because I don't want to mess with it. We have this Dora doll. This is um, a replacement. Um, it, it goes with a toy. These things, the baby toys, I'll more than likely lot them up. I will look them up. I've not heard of Sassy. It's just like a little rattle. Never seen that before. That's what I'm doing here. I'm gonna get this out of the package and see what it is. Oh my goodness. I have scissors right here. Use those scissors. Okay, is this some sort of some sort of Hong Kong, um, I don't know. Definitely gonna look it up and see what it does. Anybody ever seen one of those? Be interesting to see if it works. Um, I don't know. Oh, I bet that goes to him. It looks the same color. I'll just sit it beside him just in case. Okay. Um, a replacement head. <gasps> All right. We got something else in here. We got another marble. We got this little girl right here. I think she's Fisher Price also. Opening up this. I have no idea. It looks like some sort of castle. Which I don't typically mess with stuff like this unless it's worth a lot of money. So I don't like shipping it and I don't think this is complete. It's really dirty. Um, It looks old. It says Muppet Babies. Um, let me adjust my camera here. All right, Muppet Babies. It 
Looks like it's missing the toppers. This definitely took up a lot of the box, so I'm hoping it's like decent. But if not, I should still do pretty well. Um, looks like it folds out. And I'm not even sure. Hmm. I don't know. I'll have to look it up. It says 1989 in there. And that's it, guys. So I... I'm going to get listing and pop up screen shares for you guys so I can help you learn, help me learn, and we'll see how much we're going to make on this box. Thanks for watching. Okay, Bola Buddies, let's talk numbers. I got this box for $100 from YouTube Channel Auctions for You. She has selling events that are great for resellers on her channel. She also does selling events over on Donatella Bottolino's channel. So, again, it was a mystery toy box that I paid $100 for from Auctions for You. I got 50 listings out of it, so that's about $2 per listing. Items not sold yet with sale turned on equals a total of $1,000 and or I'm sorry, $1,038. 8 items have sold so far for a total of 10160. Active and sold's total $1,139.60. I have best offer turned on, so let's take another 15% off for unsold items for around 155.70. Additional 15% off to cover fees for a total of $170.94. So let's take $812.96 minus $100, what I paid for the box, and that leaves me a profit of over $700. This is just a quick breakdown. I could make a little more or a little less. I try to be conservative with my box breakdown numbers. I also just want to disclose I did not include shipping in the totals. That was just the cost of the item. So... That would make a difference also. Be sure to check out the description of the video. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.